self-defense is not just for men, it's for women. And it's important that you understand that the techniques do not have to be complicated or uh, convoluted or anything like that. They should be simple, practical, and powerful. And I like to teach techniques that are fun and also very effective. And, and we can look at historical situations sort of like, uh, let's take that Brett Kavanaugh situation. He had the girl pinned down with his hand on her throat and for 30 years she's afraid and scared and had all these issues. If she had trained with us, and when I say us, I mean martial artists, she could have went to any dojo, not just mine, but granted, you should come to mine. But the bottom line is, if she had trained with the right people, she would have learned the technique that could flip that entire situation and turn right around and be in charge, and he would have been the one that would have been afraid for the next 30 years. Sort of like this. Now, this is the way you're supposed to end up, where he's having an issue and I'm feeling fine. So you gotta come to our dojo. We're at Budo Pavilion in San Pedro, Pacific and 11th, and you can check us out on budopavilion.com, and more importantly, you can come to our Lady Self-Defense class every Friday night at seven o'clock. We'll go over this technique and many, many others. Keep it simple, keep it fun, stay in charge. Have fun.